How has business patterns changed over the years? And enormously, enormously. Um, uh, back in the back in the early years uh, of my business career, uh, retail re retail business uh, was of the order of uh, every practically every uh, every family. Uh, in, in the commercial world, uh, had a uh, had a shop, had a shop. There no, there no, there was no such thing in those days as um, uh, as of having a supermarket. Supermarket. Nobody knew what a supermarket was in those days. Uh, not in 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 today's in today's world of business. It's a, Supermarkets uh, at the real McCoy. Long ago, there, as I said, family, families, uh, the business families uh, had shops, 300 square feet, 400, 500 million, maybe a thousand square feet. There, uh, 2,000 would be a big, a big, um, a, a big shop. Whereas today, uh, many times uh, uh, more bigger than that. When did the first supermarket come to town? Well, to the best of my uh, 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 of my memory, uh, I, I think uh, uh, my own shop was, uh, uh, as I said to you, uh, my own shop was uh, at about two thousand square feet, and. Uh, in 1972 was the year um, that we converted. Um, of course, today a supermarket of 2,000 square feet is no use. It got to be huge. Okay. What was tourism like in Westport? Tourism started in Westport, I think, uh, with when the reality dawned. That things were things were changing in a big way. It started to boom. At, I think about nineteen, say nineteen eighty or or so. Mm. Uh, before that, it, it it was talked about. It wasn't talked about much. The there were no there was only there was only Carroll's Hotel on on the Octagon. The railway hotel below on the Mall, John Jeffers, uh, and I think that was about all the hotels. Su subsequently, um, all the other hotels that you that you have here now um, uh, have, uh, have have made Westport uh, a haven for for tourists. Who pushed the tourism in Westport initially? Well. It, 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 um, the initial uh, show for, for tourism, uh, I think now, uh, was when uh, the, the the biggest fishing fest fishing festival in the country was in Westport back in the eighties, and that was run by uh, four or five guys, but it was uh, oftentimes you would have. Um, you would have a few hundred, and I mean a few hundred, maybe two or three hundred fishermen uh, de de descending on Westport uh, each each year for a, a week festival, uh, and and that put it on the map. That put Westport on the map because mm. people came from France and Germany, and the American air, the, the American forces that were uh, living on the continent uh, as a result of, of the war, which had finished uh, twenty or thirty years before that. Um, when did the Gulf take off? Uh, or what started that? Just a minute. The fishing festivals uh, lasted about ten years. Um, and when when they uh, when they finished with, with the thing, uh, the people who who ran the, the fishing festival 
uh, three or four of them uh, got together and started um, started what's known as the Westmorton District Tourist Development Company Limited. There were 20 people, all all Westport fellows, uh, all business people uh, uh, abroad in 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 that uh, company, uh, and I I would say that it was the start of the business because hotels started popping up. Um, Uh, in order for that they would uh, be able to accommodate uh, the, the visitors that were starting to come in. Uh, I, I have a photograph uh, of them, but I, I, I unfortunately, uh, I don't know where it is. Can you remember who was in that group? I can. Well, some of them I know. Some, some of the people. Tommy Brennan was, 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 he was, a, he was in the post office. Uh, he, uh, he walked in the post office, a man from Galway. Um, oh, and a very good guy. It was he who spear, spearheaded the, the fishing thing, and again, I think he st he, he, he uh, spearheaded the uh, uh, the tourist development company. Uh, 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 an inflammable character at times, but he's a great a great guy. Uh, Benny McAleer was in it. Uh, Michael Joe Gibbons was in it. Stephen Welch was in it. Um, uh, John Jeffers, of course, and all the people who had hotels at, at that stage. 